These guns are not real. No. These are merely toys for the use of childlike entertainment and for this movie. Is that good? Yeah, but show it like what it uses. Huh? BBs. BBs. Yeah, so these are not real. Nope. Okay. Please don't get mad. Okay. This is John, aka the Blazing Asian. He's part of uh, our SWAT division. As you can see, he got nice clean sneakers. Bling, top of the line, bling, bling from New York. Look at that. He's got the bandana gorilla outfit. He's got, oh snap, a bulletproof vest. And a, and a crazy gun because he's in SWAT. Got anything to say? Do you know it's a special ops member for SWAT team grade A? He is not one to be messed with. He has killed 2,000, no, 3,000 men by himself in a room alone. And say something. Ah! <laughs> That's his battle roar! Right. <laughs> this is Jarek with uh, civilian SWAT clothes. He's rocking the Desert Eagle and the nice blingity bling watch because he gets paid a lot. And uh, yeah, you want to say something? <laughs> oh my god, a terrorist! A terrorist! This is Daniel, aka Atheist. He is a terrorist and um. Terrorists can uh, wear anything practically. They're um, the enemy of SWAT teams and we have to protect and serve people from them. Terrorists. Before we start, we have to plan since we are we SWAT, SWAT team. team. Special weapons special and Special ops, special right. tactical unit. Here's what we're gonna do guys. Go we're gonna, here. We're gonna go in and like, he's gonna be right here. So we're gonna come in in a helicopter. And again from behind. Then and you then take we'll the speed, just, you take the, the boat. Yeah, and then we'll just take them out from there. Yes. Okay, let's go, guys. Perfect. Let's go. Stop. You're gonna witness a live SWAT action raid. Are you ready? Hoorah! Oh, <laughs> go! The enemy! Ready? Go, kill! Is what SWAT teams do when they're not fixing problems everywhere else. We train and we practice. Let's go to the shooting range, shall we? Here we see a fake dummy of a terrorist. Here is Gino practicing his shooting. See how he holds his gun and how he reloads. See how he cocks the gun. See how the terrorist acts like a terrorist and does not act like anything else. <laughs> we also have to keep in shape. Thus, we have to work out. Example. Look how he lifts his both of his arms in an upward motion. Look how tightly he grips the weights. He cocks it up and down. It works out your arms and your abs. Okay, okay, okay. We work five hours a week, 12 hours a day, and we only do our SWAT business and get down and dirty when we are needed. 
Yeah, when the cops can't handle it. Right, guys? Yeah! Right, guys? <laughs> yeah. You have to be physically fit for the SWAT series. Example. <laughs> there you go. We SWAT are in our top shape. We are in a prime. We are between the ages of uh, 19 and 35. And we are still the best. This guy is well trained. See the we read this. Come on, read this badge. It says wildfire combat. He, he's he's freaking SWAT team. He's so good like that. And um, yeah. Uh, this job is you know realistic for us because it teaches us uh, moral values and and teamwork. Uh, and teamwork. That's the most important. Teamwork. <laughs> teamwork. Teamwork. Yeah. And um, value, I mean like Work ready? ethic, work ethic Work ethic It's a must for this job You have to be on time everywhere Every okay. single, If you're late for one second and someone dies, it's on you You're a boss It's on you You're a boss You know, in the physical characteristics of this job You cannot be obese, anorexic You got to be You gotta be sexy fit. You gotta be sexy, you know? Fit. <laughs> and, um, yeah. Knowledge, skills. Yes. Those Talk are. About it. That's what you need to become SWAT. SWAT stands for. Special Tactics. Uh, special Weapons. Winning <laughs> at training. Training. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Else. One more important thing is. Additional requirements. You have to give it your all, even your life. You have 110 to. One hundred ten percent. Yes. Cannot be ninety nine percent. You gotta be ninety nine thousand percent. Thousand. You know, that's pretty much it. What did you learn from this experience? I learned teamwork and guns. <laughs> 